basically it won't be done until December, hopefully like end of December, beginning of January. So here's everything that I have so far. I have my crash bar in here, um, the couplers and the fitting. I still have the intercooler and the piping that's back at home, well, the other house. Everything we have, we have the 30 row oil cooler that I've had. I uh, just got the flex fuel kit, so the Special GZ uh, flex fuel kit. So we got that last night. Had the injectors. These are the 1300 cc injector dynamics. I have the twin Hellcat, and actually the twin 525 pumps in the CJM top hat. So this will be our fuel, or well, twin fuel pumps. The only thing I'm waiting on now is my fuel return system and then the actual supercharger itself. So other than that with fueling, like we have everything except the return system right now. And then everything else is back at the house. All that's in here is like just the crash bar. So like nothing really worth showing. And then we have the spoiler I plan on putting on. If not, I might sell it get a V1 uh, Nismo spoiler because I do want to get the Nismo rear bumper, which I plan on getting. So other than that, that's an update with all the parts that I have. I've literally just been waiting on the supercharger from Soho. It's been 11 months since I've ordered it. So I'm just waiting for them to ship it. I should be getting it any day now. So I'll keep you guys updated on that. But for tonight, the Z had an oil leak. So we finally got it fixed today. And just going to take it out. I haven't driven it in like a month other than today. But I didn't do any pulls or anything because it was half full in oil. So I just put more oil in it gonna put some gas in it and gonna wash the engine bay because there's a bunch of oil that was in there and then we'll take it out and do just a little couple little pulls and this will probably be the last naturally aspirated pulls I'll be doing in this car until the day of installing the supercharger since I don't drive the Z really anymore. <laughs> it feels so like weird to drive the Z haven't driven in forever. my car feels so fast right now just because i've been driving the toyota for like a month straight and i like barely give it any gas because it has so many miles on the transmission but so this car feels like such a night and day difference it makes me appreciate my z so much more now that i'm not even daily in it like now it's just like a fun just car to have i knew i'd be more thankful for my z once i uh, had it daily so i'm excited but nervous to do a pull at the same time because, I don't know, just a lot of stuff's been going downhill lately, so, I don't know, hopefully the Z will be fine doing some pulls. <laughs> well, it's been a couple days after. Did some pulls, car was fine. Still not leaking oil, thankfully. See, not really leaking any oil anymore, thankfully. So we're just waiting on the supercharger, really, and the fuel return system. But the fuel return system will be here a lot sooner than the supercharger. Guys, there's not much else to film. All we can do is wait, try cleaning the engine bay off to get a lot of the oil off. I did get a good bit of the oil off. Thankfully, so that's about it. If you guys have any other ideas you, for some videos that we make for the time being, feel free to let me know. I'll be selling my intake soon, so if any of you guys want 
intakes, just let me know in the comments and uh, we can exchange info. But yeah, that is about it. All we can do is wait. I plan on having a V2 Nismo bumper in the rear, or at least a Nismo bumper in the rear. So then it'll look a lot better. And maybe put some headers on it. So, not sure yet. I mean, I want to. Just depends on the budget. But, yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this little update video. And kind of this is why I haven't been uploading anything. Because uh, just the car's been the same. I really haven't done much. So I'm just waiting for the supercharger. So I will see you guys later.